What's good, everybody? My name is Jay Fatty. Today, I got a little something different. I'm going to actually show you how you can upload to BeatStars. I'm going to show you the process that I do and how I get my beats up on there so I can sell them, all right? So it's kind of a simple process, but it takes a little bit of time, but you get used to it. So the first thing you're going to want to do is obviously have your beat mixed and mastered, everything on the mixer tracks, everything ready to go, okay? Because we're going to need to export a untagged wave we're going to need to export the stems and then we're going to need to export the tagged mp3 okay so the first step that i do is export the stems now you have to make sure everything's on a mixer track like i said otherwise you're not going to be able to export the individual stems so first thing we want to do is go to file export wave go into a new folder and call it stems all right have a folder called stems and then in that folder make a new folder and call it your beat this beats called situation all right now we can double click in that new folder we just created and hit save now when this pops up we're going to want to have the 32-bit float for wave stereo um you want to have your save playlist mark this shit you don't necessarily have to have but you want to make sure you have enable insert effects on enable master effects and make sure you do split mixer tracks. This is how you're going to get the stems. We're going to hit start and then it'll do its thing. All right, now once it exports the stems, we're going to go on to the wave, the untagged wave. So we'll go up into here, file, export, wave again. This time we're going to go into a different folder. Now I put my untagged waves in a vibes folder. Okay, so I'm just going to put this in soul. Then I'll hit save and then make sure I uncheck split mixer tracks because I just want the one wave track with everything consolidated in that track. I don't want it all split individually. Now, while that's going, I'm going to go into my stems folder and find that new folder that I just created for this beat, the situation. All right, and I'm going to double check to make sure it saved all of the tracks. Here it is. Okay, so that on the FL Studio just got done. But inside the stems, we can see that it saved all of the stems here exactly how we wanted. Now we're going to want to go back and right-click that folder and go to Send to Compress Zip Folder. Otherwise, we're not going to be able to upload it because it'll be too big. We want to compress it down. So let that compress. Now, this is where we're going to go find our beat tag and drag that into the beat because now we need the tagged MP3. All right, so here's my tag. I gotta affect it real quick, so I'll just double click, put my effects on here. Got it to a mixer track. Put my tag effects. All right, now let's see how the tag sounds with the drop. Yo, Fatty, roll a J. Now what I can do is go to File, Export, MP3 and then go to a different folder. So I'm gonna have three folders here, one for my stems, one for the untagged wave, and then one for the tagged MP3. I could save it in here, make sure everything's good, it's good, hit start, and now it's going to save the tagged MP3. All right, now we're gonna go to BeatStars. When we're at BeatStars, we can just hit upload, upload new. I'm gonna drag this to the side here, grab uh, my folder browser, and we're gonna go into these beats, and I like to upload the stems, then the tagged mp3, then the uh, the untagged wave. So I'm just going to find the situation stems here. Make sure you grab the stem that you consolidated. So here it is. Situation. Where is it? There it is. So I can just drag that in. I wanted the consolidated one, the zip folder. Otherwise, it will be too big. Now I'm going to go get the tagged mp3. There it is, drag that in. Now we're gonna go for the untagged wave, okay? And I put that in soul. Here it is. All right, so we got the zip, the MP3 and the wave. We're just gonna hit upload and it's gonna start doing its thing. We'll just let it upload here. Depends on your internet, how long it'll take. Now as your track's uploading, we can go ahead and put in the information here. So we'll put in the title of the beat. So I'll just do like a soulful, uh, we'll do soulful little baby type beat. And then put in some tags, just little baby, soulful, maybe just type beat. 
All right, now our stuff's uploaded, we can start putting it in. So the tagged beat, we'll just put in the MP3. The track stems, we'll put in the zipped folder here. Then the untagged wave, just the wave. All right, now we can keep going here, scroll down a little bit. You can mess with some stuff here, mess with your um, selling preferences, free download options, um, require downloaders to do something if, before they can free download it. Right here, you can put in your third-party loops and samples. So if you're using a loop from Cymatics or anything, this is where you would put that in. And then we'll mess with the track details here. Primary genres, hip-hop, subgenre. We'll, we'll just do trap for right now. Because there's not that many options there. Primary mood, we're going to do soulful. Soulful. And then we'll do bouncy for the secondary mood. And this is, you know, this is per track, so put in what your track is. And then the key's A major. All right. And now, if you have collaborators on here, you can put in your collaborators. I do have a collaborator, DC the Beatmaker. Shout out DC. So I'll add him. Now, if they're on BeatStars, they'll come up here. If they're not on BeatStars, you're going to have to get them on BeatStars, obviously. There's the homie. He's a producer. And then we'll split the share 50-50. And then boom, you put in your cover art, obviously. So let me get some cover art. Choose this side right here. I just found an image on Google. All right, it's going to upload that. And that's pretty much it. You can hit save draft. Make sure you double check everything. Looks all good. Hit save draft. And then hit publish. And then there you go. You have just uploaded a track. So yeah, if this video brought value to you, please leave a like, hit subscribe, and hit that little bell. I really do appreciate y'all. It would also mean the world if you could check out my new beat tape that I just released. It's like a drill soul, kind of trap soul, really nice vibe um, beat instrumental tape on all streaming services. It'll be the first link down in the description. So please go check that out. But yeah, until next time, make sure you stay safe, stay striving, and always be getting it. Much love, everybody. Peace.